Thank you. to me late this afternoon, so it's small font, and I have poor eyes. Oh. <laughs> Here we go. Good evening to all of you. I am so sorry that I'm not able to be with you tonight, but to be honest, I'm taking my oldest granddaughter to look at colleges today. I'll be home in the district Sunday and Monday. I truly regret that I'm not able to spend time with you because both the Republican Party and I owe you a debt of gratitude for all that you do. You are the heart and the soul of the party and all that is good in our nation. Our nation stands at a crossroads this 2012. There are two very different visions for the United States of America. One is a vision where the federal government is involved in most aspects of our lives, from health care to housing to our finances and energy policies. As the federal government grows larger and larger, the fewer freedoms we have. This is a vision of Barack Obama. If you listen to the State of the Union, you've heard that he does not respect the three branches of government, oops, sorry, <clears throat> and seeks to work around the other branches with the appointment of czars as well as appointments of members to the NLRB board and the Consumer Protection Financial Board. Our goal this election must be to defeat this president who is on the path to destroy all that our nation stands for. We will do this together this fall by uniting behind the Republican candidate. The other vision for this nation is one where the individual retains his, his or her freedom. And understanding that these rights and freedoms are intrinsic to our nature as humans and the only legitimate role of the government is to protect those freedoms. As, na as a nation, where the American dream comes to exist for our kids and our grandkids. A nation that encourages hard work and does not punish success. This is what is at stake this November 2010. I look forward to working alongside with all of you to protect these very principles that our country was founded on, our nation is worth fighting for. I want to take this opportunity to invite all of you to the grand opening of our campaign office on Saturday afternoon, February 25th. Please come see our new office and hear about some of our campaign initiatives. I won't be. It will be a good opportunity for me to express my appreciation to all of you. And David Gray, are you here, David? Somewhere? I know I saw you. There he is. Sure. David Gray is our new campaign manager, and uh, hopefully you've had an opportunity to meet with him. <clears throat> but he'll be able to provide you with more information about the event. I want to thank Tom Davey. Happy birthday, Tom.